don't even know if I really need a microphone, but he's using one, so. Sure, <laughs> glad <laughs> um, My name is Ariana, and um, when I heard about uh, Seeds Please, when I got the invite, um, the first thing that occurred to me was to start going through my journals and thinking a lot about the season. I'm deeply bonded to nature and what I noticed was um, that in my stream of consciousness writings um, that I was writing from the perspective of being nature. And given that um, we had ice yesterday. Uh, I was kind of worried that it might be really bright and sunny and all of a sudden the world would explode with flowers and this would be completely inappropriate, but I'm cool. Um, so, what uh, I'm doing tonight is I have fashioned a couple of pieces um, of poetry, bent them a little bit into lyric, and I'm representing myself um, as Quebec. Now, she is the wise woman, um, the veiled one, the blue hag, the crone of winter. Um, anyone who looks up her stories or you find out about her, you're going to find lots of different stories ranging from Wales all through to Scotland. Um, about what she does. I won't go into a lot of that. But basically, she controls the weather as well as looks after the land. She veils the land over the dark half of the year. And come spring, she unveils. In some stories, she becomes one of the hills, one of the she, or a rock. In some stories, she's the triple goddess, and she becomes the spring goddess. What's laying here in front here, please pick them up. Anybody, pick these up. Yeah, yeah, I'll pick them up, I'll pick them up. All of these, all of these, except for those little eggy things, all of them contain seeds. <laughs> At a point in uh, getting into the performance, you're going to hear me do something really loud with some brass zins right here. That's going to be your signal. I want you to make a lot of noise with those seeds. We're going to wake up spring. Okay. Sound good? I'll test them. Change 
weaving through the spider web branches. Fingers tell wearing deep blues and reds of the nut, seed, and hips, the gems of her age. The flowers are dreaming as the crows draw the veils of cloud across the late blue sky, a great cape of silvers and gray. Birds swam the waves of the ocean above as she flies with her cloaks of midnight stars float down from the sky and it is time to rest embraced in the warm roots of her arms it is time to dream the flowers are dreaming Sing you a morning of dreams. And I'll sing. 